Hey guys, welcome to Henley. Let's face the stern. Bow, swing towards me. Stop that. <laughs> Lenny. <laughs> I'm not a good outfit. I'm not a good We just finished up with practice. Um, first time on Henley. Um, it's, it's Jane, duck, duck. Oh, it's good to be here. Good to represent Texas. And we're looking forward to Friday when the racing starts. Hook em horns. Very permanent watches, lots of good time, got a lot of American crews here, We're gonna dress up, people love the bolo tie, gotta represent. Just, I don't want to interrupt, but this is the real behind the scenes of being out of Fancy Blaze, the awkwardness. Sounds good. It's the first day of the Yes. And the remnant. Well, I think the, I think you're right. That's the junior. This is chicken curry. No, no, you're watching. Oh, it's a <laughs> it's a ring watch. I mean, the food is. Uh, yeah, that's really interesting. <laughs> Big one tomorrow. Okay? So good job. 
Again, this is the Remenham Challenge Cup, the Open Women's Eights event. Here they go. It's Texas against Hollandia Roikel of the Netherlands. It's the US against the Dutch. My goodness, Catherine, the, te the Texans seem to have taken the race to the Netherlands. We and well, Texas continue to dominate this race, actually. Really powerful row, really aggressive row here. What do you see? I like that, because I think, I think, you know, the question was asked of Texas, can you sustain this? Can you keep this up? And, and the answer is, yes, we can. Texas cops by Rexel Ray, and beautifully controlled race, really aggressive race. And, uh, well, the Dutch challenge right through the middle as they cross the line, too, just the length between them challenge hard through the middle but it was Texas's day to go through to the next round in the Remnant Challenge Cup with a win over Colombia. That was great. Proud of you. Great warm up. Yeah. Yeah. Really set the tone. Yeah. So it was awesome. I was like, I, I, those all my nerves went away when we when we did our warm up. Um, it was a great race, super windy, um, tough conditions, but we powered through, we got a good start out from the islands and then just kept going and it was it was nice and smooth and clean. Um, but obviously tomorrow we have a big race against uh, GB senior national team, which was super excited to get the opportunity to race them. And we're just gonna have a ton of fun with it and gain a load of experience. They took confidence, the rhythm, the joy going to the school. We do that and they will they will notice, okay, and you'll be the mark for them. Okay. So nothing desperate, nothing chaotic, just calm, cool, confident, technical all the way down. Absolutely right, and uh, brilliant uh, scenes of the Texas State. There's yeah. a Texas play to kill. Yeah, and you can see it right here. I mean, that's some really good rowing, you know. And I guess we should say hook em. <laughs> Hook'em horns. Hook'em <laughs> horns, and I'm doing the horn signal here in the commentary box. I know you can't see me, but that's the kind of Texas. Yeah, they are in front, coming up to the finish line. Leander A Club take that semi-final of the Remenham Challenge Cup ahead of their challenges from the University of Texas, USA. I really like how th they rode all the way through. They, even through the finish there, uh, they had a really good race. Their rowing was crisp and clean, um, and they just rode well. And I think they rode within themselves and they gave all they had. So uh, I'm, I'm really proud of the performance that they put in here against such a strong Leander crew. Thanks for, thanks for the last few weeks. Okay, and I do feel like, yeah, ending this year on a good note, so job well done. Seniors, way to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, it's all, like, because of that race. Like, we showed everyone that, like, we're capable of throwing something down and, like, wearing it proud and 
you know, doing everything that we can, and that's all that counts. Season comes to a close. Pick up horns. Go Texas. Woo!